What's up, YouTube? And welcome back to Life with Gollywood. And it is 2018. Welcome to 2018. Now, I know. <laughs> I know a lot of you guys need tips or want tips on things that should be left in 2017 and things that should not be left in 2017. So I am starting a hair review series for the month of January. So, the first review is going to be on Kendra's Boutique Hair. And I did post, no, is it post reviews or pre-reviews? Which one is that when you do it? Initial review. I did initial reviews on, I think, two different types of hair or two or three different types of hair. So, I'm going to be giving you guys feedback on it now. Now, the first thing is Kendra. Does it last? I personally feel like it does, but I know other people who will disagree for me it lasts because i dyed and bleached this hair two times and it still looks and feels just like how i got it and right now i have a lot of products in it so i was even surprised it was able it was um it was able to straighten this well and i left this side curly because i wanted to show you guys how long these curls last does the hair hold curls very well and y'all already know my answer to that like what other hair lasts for like three months or two months i'm dragging it with three months what other hair lasts for two months with curls none i've never personally experienced that and right now kendra is at the top of my list for hair that holds curls because this is this is ridiculous that's why i could not straighten one side i really had to let you guys know and you know me i'm all about making my views effective or whatever i've had these curls in here since november ending for for um thanksgiving break when i was going down to maryland i put my hair in flexi rods the night before thanksgiving and on thanksgiving day i took it out and it's been like this ever since and all i really have to do is just brush out the hair or just run my hands through it and it's honestly good as new the curls are all bouncy and very nice number two does the hair shed i feel like the hair does not shed as much as other hairs do but it still sheds you know it doesn't excessively sheds like crazy like a freaking cat every time i run my hands through my hair or even brush it so I felt like that was definitely a plus. Oh, so since we were just talking about the curls, and now we are on to the closure. How is the closure? I felt like the closure is kind of iffy because it actually does not hold curls as well as the bundles, which was kind of weird to me because it's the same hair. So like, why doesn't it hold the curls as well? Like for example, this right here, I legit recurled the front before I did this video. And it's already flat and I've had these curls in for months and it's still in there so Kendra got some questions to answer me like you know like what's what's going on are y'all buying from different people like is it from different countries I don't know what it is but that was the only thing that kind of threw me off with the hair and and I feel like the closure looks pretty 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 scalpy looks like my scalp or whatevs what products do I use for my hair? I only use silicone mix products. I don't know why. So the only thing that I do that's kind of weird is that after, okay, I wash my hair about once every three months. It's in a wig, so I'm not wearing it as much. I don't need to be washing it every month or so. But what I do is that I wash my hair with the silicone mix bamboo shampoo for um probably like once every two three months or whenever i feel like the hair needs to be washed and when i put it in the silicone mix i leave that in for for 30 to two hours depending on the um on how i'm gonna leave the hair the hair actually came in naturally body weight so you know if i'm trying to have a body weight that's when i leave the hair in for like about f like two hours but if I'm trying to have it straight, I only leave it in for like 30 minutes max because I did the mistake of leaving it in more than that. And the hair just came out very stringy and I it was I just looked like a wet dog. Like it was not cute. So that had to go. That's one thing I learned. The webs of the hair itself is not that thick, which is kind of good. 
you don't want the worst too thick and your hair is all like bumpy and everything okay guys that was all i hope you guys loved the review and my feedback and i hope you guys come back for more and do not forget to subscribe bye